Hi, everybody. Today's flip along is The Night Before the Fourth of July by Natasha Wing, illustrated by Amy Wummer. Twas the night before July 4th, and all across the USA, Americans were gearing up for Independence Day. Mom tied up the bunting while I gave Dad a hand. We hung up the flag from our porch stand. That night we both slept sprawled out in our beds, while visions of fireworks popped in our heads. The next morning, we dressed up in red, white, and blue. I even wore stars, one on each shoe. We lined up on Main Street. Look, here come the parade floats. Hooray for the marching band and the 4-H club goats. The mayor tossed candy. I shouted, here, here. And Uncle Sam walking on stilts brought up the rear. Friends and family came over for a backyard barbecue. Dad fired up the grill as a storm started to brew. The goodies were set on the picnic table with care. Get them while they're hot, hollered Dad, flipping burgers into the air. But just when we sat down, it started to pour. Grab the food, shouted Mom. And we raced through the door. In hot dogs, in salads, in blueberry pie, in melon and corn, keep those potato chips dry. We gathered in the kitchen and spilled into the hall. Squeeze in, said Mom. There's room for us all. As we munched on our food, Grandma turned to Grandpop. There will be no fireworks show if this rain doesn't stop. What? We all shouted. No rockets, red glare? Fourth of July without fireworks? That's totally not fair. When what to our wondering eyes should appear? With the rain suddenly stopping, the sky was now clear. We piled in the car and drove to the park. We threw down a blanket as it began to grow dark. Dad lit the sparklers. We drew circles in the air. We snapped glow sticks on our wrists and glow halos in our hair. The first firework was launched high into the night. It bloomed like a flower exploding with light. Whiz, crackle, boom. Woohoo! cheered the crowd. But my brother covered his ears and whimpered, that's too loud. The band played the national anthem. Dead sang, oh say can you see? That's when I covered my ears because he was way out of key. And now the grand finale. Wow, the best I'd seen yet. A sky filled with color, a show I'll never forget. When the last firework fizzled like fairy dust in the sky, we all cheered and shouted, Happy Fourth of July! Thanks for reading along with us. Come back next week for another story.